Now that Tesla has started building the Giga Texas Giga Factory, let's talk about the Tesla factory comparison, depicting Giga Factory Texas as gargantuan size. It's huge size. It's the biggest factory that Tesla is building right now. Welcome back, dear friends. This is Armin Haryan from TorqueNews.com, and you're watching a good video from our friend Randy, who has sent us this drone video, and you will find the Randy's YouTube channel in the description of this channel. So please subscribe to his channel and also. So please subscribe to our channel and ring the bell so you don't miss my next Tesla story. If you would like to know more about Giga Texas, Giga Berlin, Giga Shanghai, and much more about Tesla and electric cars. Tesla factories, or at least the land that it acquires for its production facilities, seem to be getting progressively larger with each iteration. For example, see how large is Giga Texas that you're seeing on your screens right now. This is particularly evident when one looks at the scale comparison comparing the Gigafactory Texas site to the company's previous facilities. As it turns out, Giga Texas will indeed be gargantuan electric vehicle complex. That means huge electric vehicle production complex. Tesla enthusiast and Model 3 owner U Branded Dude ADS S7 of the Tesla Motors subreddit recently posted a scale comparison depicting Tesla's existing production facilities with its Tilburg, uh, from its Tilburg plant in the Netherlands to the recently announced Austin, Texas Giga, Giga Texas factory. A look at the facilities, both existing and planned, shows two things. One, the electric car maker seems to have developed a solid strategy to build its planned effi plants efficiently. And two, the land where the plants are getting built is getting progressively bigger. The first point is pretty much represented by a comparison of Tesla's Fremont factory and Giga factory Shanghai. The two facilities are quite comparable in size, but it is not too difficult to see that the latter is more optimized for the electric car makers operations. This is all but highlighted in Giga Shanghai's Model 3 ramp, which has proven to be much faster and smoother than the ramp in the Fremont plant. The Gigafactory Berlin complex dwarfs the property where Gigafactory Shanghai is being built on. However, even the massive property in, G in Germany seems small compared to the Austin, Texas site. During the second quarter earnings call, Elon Musk noted that Gigafactory Texas will be built on a 2,000 acre property that's about 5 minutes from Austin International Airport and 15 minutes from Austin downtown. That's massive extent of expanse of land and it's enough to hold an electric vehicle manufacturing plant and what Elon Musk describes as an ecological paradise complete with a boardwalk, lots of trees, streams and a hiking and biking trail. What's more, Giga Texas will be the first Tesla facility that will be open to the public. It's about 2,000 acres and we're going to make it a factory that is going to be stunning. It's right on the Colorado River. So we're actually going to have a broad boardwalk where there will be hiking, biking trail. It's going to be basically an, be an ecological paradise. Birds in the trees, butterflies, fish in the stream, and it'll be open to the public as well. So not closed and only Tesla, Musk said. Looking at the size of Gigafactory Texas complex, friends, compared to Tesla's other facilities, it is not difficult to imagine large sections of the complex being dedicated for public use. Considering its size, perhaps Gigafactory Texas could very well end up as the first Tesla city of sorts, being a facility that runs on sustainable power while showcasing, showcasing the company's lineup of vehicles and energy products. Well, friends, while you're uh, watching uh, the rest of Randy's video of Gigafactory Texas, please let me know what you think about the size of Giga Texas. I think Tesla will have a lot of lines here. Uh, one of them uh, building Model 3, M M M Model Y, another building the Cybertruck pickup truck, another building another um, uh, Tesla Semi, and maybe much more. Who knows Tesla, where Tesla will build its Tesla vans, which I reported this morning. So let me know what you think. And thank you, Randy, my friend, for sending this 
video and all our friends from different Giga factories that sent Torque News these videos to share with our friends and helping me to chronicle Torque uh, true Torque News Giga factories of Tesla. And uh, friends, subscribe to our channel, please. This is Armin Harian from our torquenews.com, and I'll see you in our next report. Have a great day and please keep watching Randy's videos and please like this video to show your appreciation of Randy's work and all the local guys who helped me to bring these stories to you. God bless you. Take good care of each other and peace be with all of you. See you soon in our next report.